Hello there you guys, this is going to be a reading for my friends, um, she's a reader herself, we just trade sometimes, but um, she felt comfortable or she, you know, kind of put out there that I could post this video publicly. Um, sometimes some reader, like some readings for clients or like, you know, public readings that we do for friends or family sometimes they'll resonate with others out there. So that can happen. So I won't put it past spirit. There was a reason why she asked for me to do it and felt comfortable or fine with me posting it publicly. So I don't mind um, doing it for her. So maybe, you know, spirit has a way of working things. Maybe you can resonate with her reading. So um, you asked as far as the rebuilding, um, how will he do so? So how will he go about rebuilding the relationship with you, like between the both of you? How will he go about rebuilding? Okay. okay. See how the five of emotional loss. I'll go ahead and pull clarifiers on that. Um, your second question was. If I see you coming back to the U.S. again, so let's see. Okay, so I have harmony, um, and then you said the time frame. So about what time frame do I see the entry happening? So I'm gonna ask Spirit, what is the time frame that you can give her as far as? her entry back into the U.S. Okay, trapped in fear. Um, so let's go ahead and clarify. So the first question you asked was how will um, he rebuild the relationship? How will he go about it? Well, I have emotional loss. So let's see. These cards flew out. Let's see what they say. So due to the um, circumstances between the both of you, I still feel he's holding on to some guilt about that. He does feel bad for not stepping up to the plate when he needed to. Um, so I feel like he's trying to shift out of that energy. So I feel like he will take some initiative. How do I see this happening? He's still trying to move away from um, the emotional baggage or trauma that he may have caused you and even his self from turning his back on you if that makes sense with the ace of pentacles i feel like this is more so something physical like a physical offer that he might make you um let me get more clarity i kind of feel like it's like meeting in person but it could also be like facetime or skype or something like that like something where you can see each other's faces so let me just go ahead and clarify the magician card so something illusionary something like where you have to pull a lot of strings and use a lot of like use the elements in front of you to make it happen so i feel like this will be more so like uh cyber chatting if that makes sense that he'll start first will be the offer because it has all of the elements there it's like the physical um contact you can see each other physically the emotional the um action behind it the communications so i feel like this um and it's an illusion not that it's really an illusion but it's not totally like physically based i feel like this would be um like skype or something okay then the second question you asked was do you um does it appear that you'll be coming back to the u.s do i see that so you have the six of harmony which is a major arcana card so i feel like if you do come back it will be because of him um to reconcile the the connection or just to see each other finally or see each other again um let's see you have the devil with the page of wands i kind of feel like you're 
um, limiting yourself, especially with the page of, or the uh, five of swords at the bottom, I feel like you're kind of limiting yourself and what you can do here. Like you feel like due to your circumstances, I do understand why you would be kind of worried about this question, but I do see um, that you're self-sabotaging yourself in some way. Like you're not believing in yourself. The page of wands means that there's some type of stepping out of your comfort zone that you're going to be guided to do in order to get to the U.S., but you do need to, you need to let it go. Um, like that self-sabotaging energy, that fear-based energy that you have, regardless of what it looks like on the outside, don't allow it to dictate your ability to move forward because it's like the page of wands is like you you are going to be guided to take some sort of action or you're being encouraged to take some action in a way that's a little like out of your character out of your comfort zone so the time frame again you have an um eight trapped in fear so this is a mental energy so i feel like the time frame is all based upon your perception of what you can do so i feel like you are afraid that it's just hopeless and you're not going to be able to make anything happen or there's no avenues or no possibilities. The star card means that you need to get in alignment with this. But I see that it is my, it might take some patience. I feel like it will take up to a year. Um, possibly when things, when you come into an alignment with what you really want, which is going back to the U.S. and, I, and much more that you desire when you get here um, to the US, I feel like you need to be in alignment with that. But once you do, the Knight of Pentacles tells me that this is like gonna be a work in progress for you. Like you're gonna have to have patience with yourself in the, pro the process. You're gonna have to um, get out of your fears and that might take some work. It might be a little bit of like a, a fight or some setbacks, but you are being guided to take a, like a risk that might seem like I said, out of character, out of your comfort zone, or a little childish in some sense, or naive in a sense, but it's not. Um, and I get a year at the most, a year at the most, in which you'll come back to the U.S. That's what I'm getting. Okay, so that's your reading. Um, I hope that it has helped you, and whomever else is watching it may have helped you as well. I send you guys much love. Peace.